Just like the title reads, a truck driver that works for TMC, which has 3,400 drivers. They're a flatbed company, and they're out in Des Moines, Iowa, and they go to their customers. And I know this much about flatbed companies. They have customers that have certain rules, you know, no shorts, uh, you got to have boots, no flip-flops type of thing, and you have to have a safety vest or a hard hat. And so in this situation right here, the truck driver has the complaint stating that the supervisor singled him out and even though said he did a good job, wanted him to completely buzz his hair, then he starts looking around and he sees other people with long hair. So the big question here is, was the truck driver being singled out or was the supervisor uh, worried about safety and he did the right thing? Did have hair just as long as me, if not longer. So I was wondering why I was being singled out. You know, uh, again, Comment down below. Let me know what you guys think, but this is definitely an interesting topic here. So let's get into today's video. What's going on, mother truckers? Uh, welcome to Mount Truck News. Email us at mountrucknews at gmail.com. I had truck drivers ask me to talk about this situation, and I thought this was a great topic of debate. And I would like all the mother truckers out there to comment down below how they feel about this because there's a few things that are going on. One, there's a truck driver. Uh, two, there's a trucking company actually named TMC. It's a flatbed company out of Des Moines, uh, Iowa. And the situation in hand is some people are calling this about race. Others are saying this is about safety. Let's get into this video here. And after you have all the information, you let me know how do you feel about this current situation. A Illinois man says Iowa trucking company let him go because of his dreadlocks. Drew Harvey traveled from Chicago to TMC Transportation in Des Moines for work, but weeks into the job, he said a supervisor gave him a ultimatum. A Chicago man who worked at Des Moines TMC Transportation has filed a civil rights complaint against the trucking company for wrongful termination and discrimination. Drew Harvey told Local 5 News on Thursday that he was let go by the company about two weeks ago because of a disagreement over the length of his hair. So Harvey said one of his supervisors had told him weeks into orientation that he was doing a splendid job, but said Harvey had to cut his dreadlocks by Friday or you're not going to be able to continue with this company. The supervisor allegedly told Harvey the company has a policy requiring employees have short hair in order to wear a hard hat during their shift. Harvey claimed many employees still worked with long hair, including himself. In a photo picture below, Harvey says you could see him wearing his hard hat comfortably. Quote, unquote, I was wondering why I was being singled out, he said. Harvey told his supervisor he'd trim his dreadlocks or wear his hair differently so the hard hat would fit their standards. Harvey says his hair is important to him and his culture, which is part of the reason why he didn't want to cut his hair completely. After this suggestion, Harvey claims supervised said, no, you're either going to buzz or nothing. So quote unquote from his civil lawyer. I believe that if he were a white man in the same exact position, I believe that he would have been treated differently. And that's, that's the pity. And that's why he had to contact me. We need to make sure that other people are not treated the way Drew was and thrown away like garbage and sent home on a bus after they quit their job and came to Iowa to start a new career. So Lynch said he and Harvey have not heard anything from TMC Transportation since filing the civil rights complaint a week ago. If two sides cannot come to an agreement, Lynch plans to file a lawsuit. So mud truckers, that's all your information right there. But overall, what are your thoughts about this? Harvey said that the safety hat fit him perfectly and there wasn't a problem. You know, mud truckers comment down below, what are your thoughts about this? You know, uh, some people recommended that maybe the supervisor could have said, you know, maybe add a chin strap so the hard hat could fit a little bit better. Is this a situation about being singled out or is this a situation about safety? And that's the big thing, right? So mud truckers, comment down below, let me know what you guys think.